Symbiosis is the relationships between organisms of different species in close proximity to each other. And there are various types and classifications of symbiosis. Typical classifications are mutualism, commensalism, immensalism, and parasitism. Mutualism is a relationship between organisms where both benefit from the association. An example of mutualism takes place between zebras and rhinos and a small bird called an oxpecker. These birds will land on the backs of the zebras or the rhinos and will eat ticks or other parasites from off of the animal's skin. In this relationship, the birds have access to a food source and the animals have the ticks or parasites removed from their backs. The birds can also serve as a warning system to the larger animals. This happens when the birds see danger coming, they will screech and fly off and this warns the zebras or the rhinos of the approaching danger. Commensalism is a relationship between organisms where one benefits, but no harm or benefit comes to the other species. An example of commensalism is between whales and barnacles. Barnacles will often attach themselves to the skin of a whale. This gives the barnacles access to places where food is abundant. It also provides them safety and transportation. But no harm or benefit comes to the whales through this association. Immensalism is a relationship between organisms where one negatively affects the other, but they are unaffected themselves. An example of immensalism relates to the black walnut tree. Black walnut trees excrete a chemical that kills all plants around their base or around their root. This prevents any plants from growing beneath the walnut tree, but has little to no impact on the walnut tree itself. Parasitism is a relationship between organisms where one is benefited and the other is adversely affected. There are two main classifications of parasites. There are ectoparasites and endoparasites. Ectoparasites act on the external body of the host and endoparasites work inside the body of the host. One example of parasitism is between the hornworm caterpillar and the brachinoid wasp. The wasp will lay its eggs inside the body of the hornworm caterpillar and when those eggs eventually hatch, it kills the host or the caterpillar. 